Hey there, everyone. Oh boy, uh, there's a, a lot of professionals showing up in the groups, in the Facebook groups, and these groups are to support people who leave AA. But what's happening is there's a lot of uh, new physicians and pilots, nurses, dentists are in this group. Who else do we got? everybody with a licensure right so you have pilots nurses doctors dentists and i feel like i'm leaving one out oh lawyers yeah lawyers okay so i'm i'm wondering like you know why this is happening now and i don't know why it's happening but i think it's really really important that the public know this and that anybody who is any of these professions that it is extortion when you're told that you must, you're compelled. Can you imagine being compelled to go to say like, you know, you gotta go to Cedars, you can't go to Providence St. John when you need um, some breast surgery for cancer. Uh, that would never happen, right? And so it is illegal to uh, extort somebody and say you can, you have to do this. So the strange thing is this is Alcoholics Anonymous, right? This is something that's been around since 35. It's a really old modality. Um, it's not a program, all right? AA is a very strange cult. And it's a cult because if you're told that only we can help you or that your best thinking got you here or that you're broken and that only we can fix you and they have to work these strange 12 steps that uh, I have to tell you, I, I worked them. And when I was trying to work them, uh, back in, you know, before rehab took over AA, which it certainly in, it, it infiltrated and it influenced it in a huge way. Nobody wrote about, you know, the first step or the second. You only wrote the fourth, the fifth step. Like you had your fourth, I'm sorry, your fourth step and then you read your fifth step to somebody and then you made a list of people that you harmed and, um, and then you went in, you know, uh, made apologies for them or made amends as a would say right so um it, it's really uh smart recovery is a program if you want to take a look at a real free program that support man smart recovery i'll show you uh, that if you have uh, get this out and show you uh, well actually this is for family and friends but um you know they, there's a workbook for smart recovery and it is really a great book. Okay, so what I'm making this video is for if you are a pilot, if you are, oh, let me just stop. Okay, if you're a pilot, buy this book. Okay, Hims Human Intervention Motivational Study, which is some like gobbledygook crap name for what they do to pilots. Who runs the Him program? AA members who are pilots who screwed up and got caught, okay? And so they play this game and they lay this trip on all the pilots who either go there seeking help, not knowing what they're getting themselves into. And this is endorsed by the FAA and the pilots unions and their companies, whether it's Delta, United Airlines, American Airlines, you name it. You're gonna be sent here, okay? You don't wanna go to the HIMSS program like ever. Ever. Don't, don't tell anybody there that you are seeking help. If a pilot gets like a DUI out on his own time and he gets thrown into this program, he's, you are, he or she, you're going to be sent to a psychiatrist in another state that you're going to have to pay them $2,500 for an hour. And most likely that psychiatrist, he could be a stepper. And a stepper is an AA member. That's my lingo for AA member. But the PHP program is for physicians and doctors, and it is as punitive as the pilots, okay? The nurses, you have the nursing board. So we are coming together and organizing and saying, this crap has to stop. New York AA needs to do something about it and tell all of these organizations you cannot compel people to go to our meetings. First of all, what is attraction rather than promotion? Is it one of their traditions, Alcoholics Anonymous, where it says, you know, only attraction, we don't promote. You, you, you have to come on your own. That is their whole spiel that they have, you know, been making up for decades when meanwhile, for decades, yeah, for decades, 
all of our professionals have been, have been sent to Alcoholics Anonymous meetings. And besides that, they have to go to a special group of doctors and they're, you know, they're going to be mixing in, uh, you know, other stuff that is also more AA horseshit. You can find us on Facebook, I'm Monica Richardson, and please subscribe, share, and like the buttons here. And we look forward to helping any pilot, nurse, doctor, dentist, or lawyer who is being forced to attend any kind of AA-based program, including a rehab that is gonna be all based on Alcoholics Anonymous. Thanks.